Right, guys, I'm going to play War Robots Frontiers. And yes, uh, this is on the Steam Deck. My Steam Deck is on Windows. And it's on the... It's on Windows 11 Pro. It's actually on a hub that's connected to my Acer monitor. And... Uh, and my Acer monitor is actually on a uh, thing. The Acer monitor is actually, it's saying what? Um, no issues with graphics driver. Right, so with this thing here, just ignore this, don't worry. Just tap no, because it will try and take you into the browser. If you uh, accept that message, it takes you, it tries to take you into the browser. So just kind of ignore that. Um, it's, uh, it's about the graphics card. Uh, of the Steam Deck. So you know Steam Deck doesn't have a graphics card in it. It just borrows the memory from the SSD and uh, that technology is what it uses and that's all it does. Right. So I'm playing War of Frontiers. Uh, I do play this on uh, settings on this will be uh, graphics basically is Windows full, full screen. Vertical sync is off. Uh, display gamma is 2.20 2 and overall quality is medium. And then we go to motion blur is off. Uh, frame rate limit is uh, off. And uh, what's this one? Show frame rate is off. Upscaling is FSR 1. FSR 1 mode is performance. Sharpness is 100%. And dynamic resolution is off. I do not use auto uh, detect. Uh, the next thing I go to is controls. Uh, with mine, I put uh, the mouse sensitivity was on 35%. I put it down to 7% as I found it quite difficult to control uh, the game. Right, so I'm going to put up the volume slightly uh, this on Swore Robots Frontiers. This game is playing on the Steam Deck. This does not play like streaming. This does work on the Steam Deck. But uh, the Steam Deck that I have is not on the Steam operating system. This is on Windows. Uh, so this will work it should uh, I know war robots the because the people who made war robots and this game are the same developers I do know that they um, they collaborated and made this game you know they like they're not leaving war robots they that's a popular fran franchise and that's available on iPhone and Android phones but this uh, is frontiers it's like the next step in evolution to the game so in this game, you get five robots, you get one uh, titan. Um, I think if you're not getting... If you don't get like uh, the five robots in the beginning, it's probably because it, it will give you... It will give you... Uh, what do you call this thing? Just another day on the wild tap. Right, it will it'll probably give you uh, three robots in the beginning. Uh, these robots will be probably uh, pre-built robots. But um, as you play the game and you level up in the game, it will start to give you... Um, it'll give you... It, it'll, it'll start to give you like... Um, I'm trying to think of the word... What, what word to give, what word to say. Right, guys, I, I, I kind of remembered that last time I didn't have the... Um, I think I got healing on this. Right, I'm trying to find which one actually... Right, so I don't have... I don't have Q and I don't have thrusting. Thrusting is, is the left shift. Right, I don't have Q and I don't have left uh, thrusting. So I'm gonna have to kind of let me hide let me hide my robot. I need to hide my robot and I'm gonna use uh, this is gonna be very quick what I need to do. I need to go into my profile which is on the DS4 Windows and I need to add Q and uh, left shift to my Jostens controller. So what I'm doing is I've been tapping on mine my controller to see what is um, allowing me to do the left shift and the Q and this. Um, I've, uh, I know the bumpers I'm going to use. I'm also going to use um, uh, square. So right, I'm going to leave that dude there. I'm going to press on the windows, like so. I'm going to grab DS4 windows. Ah, oh, wow, okay. No, I don't want to do that. I want to, I need to program this. So I'm going to go into profiles, 
gonna go to this one here xbox uh, gamepad click on edit um it's gonna produce this uh i want to do this quickly so i'm gonna tap on this button and select uh left shift uh that's left shift and then on uh, square i'm gonna select q and then i'm gonna say save and it should work i'm gonna put that away the disk for windows and uh put my mouse back here and now you see and now i have i have uh, i have frosting and uh, i also have q you see q is now working and uh, i've got flame pro on this dude i didn't have thrusting and i didn't have q so i needed to map my controller which i've just done as you guys have seen me doing because everything else i've got except for that uh for that um uh thrusting and uh, selecting uh using my special ability right so i'm getting hit by everybody everyone was attacking me right there so i'm actually using my flamethrowers those are called igniters and they are flamethrowers and i'm actually uh using them right now in the game uh so i'm using my flamethrowers at those guys like a deterrent because they are attacking my squad and we the, uh, we are losing a lot of robots as you see there we got hit quite hard right so the next robot has got all cans these are missiles and uh, on the top shoulder it's got a laser weapon so this robot does have a special ability that it can fire a emitting laser like it's got a laser beam at the front of it but like I told you, I didn't have thrusting. So I've just mapped my controller really quick. And now I've got thrusting there. Uh, why would you need thrusting? Well, if a robot's attacking you and you want to escape the robot, then it just makes sense to have thrusting there, you know? Just makes sense. Right, so going in, I want to see where this dude is at. Uh, it is underneath. Um. I used to not be able to uh, to actually aim. It's kind of weird. I couldn't aim before. I'm trying to attack this dude, but um, his his body is causing so much damage to me. Right. So this guy is down here. When I attack him, I'm actually healing. But uh, he's clever. He's, he's gone down, and it's still telling me that I'm getting attacked. While wow, this guy is using sound. Oh damn! Whoa! <laughs> Wow! Man, he just hit me with flamethrowers. That was it. Say when. Right. Um, so what's, what's new in the game? Uh, the pilot talks to you when you first start the game. Uh, before, the pilot would only talk if you destroyed an uh, enemy robot. And the pilot would also talk when your uh, Titan was available. But now the, the, your pilot does actually talk to you uh, before the match starts and uh still talks to you when you destroy a robot so that's the good thing and um I, I can't think of anything else right i i want to know how to reload on this uh on this thing on my on my on this game because reloading is quite important on this one i've got two pulses and i've got an all can on this dude Wow, this guy is using uh, lasers on me, but he's not causing the kind of wow. He's not causing the kind of damage he thought he was causing on me. Like I don't, use, like, I don't like using those lasers, especially if there are four of them. Right. So I can now zoom into the game before I couldn't zoom in, but I still, I, I still don't think I've got um, reload. Wait, let, let me hit this dude that's hiding there and see if I can reload. I don't have reloading, I think. Uh, I now have thrusting, I now have Q. I need to go into my settings, I just wanna... Oh wow, they got a Titan. <laughs> right, I just wanna go into the key bindings. Oh, do you know what reloading is? Okay, switching uh, camera angle to C. And then, uh, let's see. What I want is, uh, yeah, the force reload. The first reload is R.
R and what's the other one? R and C. Oh, come on. But it is showing Xbox. Yeah, but, but that, that's not working. The, the R and C are not working. So I could put... Um, I could actually put... Uh, let's see. I want to go, go to the top here because the robots are really far away. And I can't see... Ah, yeah, that's an Alpha Titan. Wow. I need R and C. So I'm actually looking at my controls and I know where I want to add those, the R and C, actually. Right, so let me do the same thing and bring in my uh, DS4 Windows thing. I'll bring this in really quick. I uh, hope no one hits me while I'm up here. I'm going to edit this. Uh, I need this bumper to be the C. Uh, so I've changed that. And I need the triangle to be the to be the R. I'm gonna save this and get back into the game. And uh, this this robot doesn't actually have any kind. Oh damn! <laughs> I didn't make it to the bottom. No, that's an Alpha Titan. So obviously. I was never going to be able to get that far. I'm going to use my mouse just to change where I um, I go to, you know. So I want to fire this, then test it. Yeah, so the force reload is working. And uh, this is to change angles, you see. The changing of angles is now working. And I can still zoom in. So I have everything I want. I've got Q, uh, Qs for the special ability of the robot. I have... Um, this, I have zooming in. Oh my, oh wow, that's that's a titan. I got thrusting. I didn't have thrusting before. Now I've got thrusting. I got Q to use the special ability of the robot. Right, so I've used the smoke screen there. Wow, th this is a robot that's after me. Oh wow, I'm using my special ability on this dude. He's got igniters, but no, he's got, um, they're not igniters, I forget what the name's called. But you see, this is not fair, there's two of them. And they all go fire on them. Oh wow, I got that one. But this dude has got, I don't know how many he's got of years. No, there's still, oh man, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die because this dude is really trying to get me. Unless he dies. Yes, nice one, good. So I've, I, I didn't have thrust in, uh, which is left shift, and I didn't, I'm going to use my smoke screen. God, I needed that because this guy was really after me. Right, now I've got force reload. I've got R, that's for force reload. Wow! <laughs> I got annihilated. Yeah, that's the Alpha Titan. Right, so I've got... I, I have got thrust in, which is a left shift. Which I've added to the top bumper using DS4 Windows. You guys can buy, uh, you can purchase. Oh wow, that's a Titan. Oh wow, wow, wow. That's a Titan there. Wow, I destroyed it. Wow, that was awesome. I got rid of that dude. I hit him hard. Right, uh, I've got two organs on this one. That's the rockets. And the middle weapon's like a sniping weapon. Um, I forget the name of the weapon, but uh, people who play War Robots will, will remember the weapon. Uh, I just I forgot what it's called, but it's a sniping weapon. Like I actually have my Titan available. Oh, I'm the only robot alive on my team. I'm the only one. Wait, let's see. I was trying to attack him with my my special weapon, but well, okay, these guys are getting mean. They're using, um, they're using their uh, sun weapons. So I had to escape. Well, I have to escape these dudes. Wow! <laughs> I got it. Ah. No, that's an Alpha Titan. Right. Okay. So, 
the gloves are off now. Oh wow, look at this dude. Oh my words. What? What button is that? I need to press a button. I need a button. I need to press for the laser. What the hell? Oh wow, I don't have another button. I didn't have F. Can you believe that? I didn't have F on this thing. I don't know what I destroyed, but uh, oh wow. They are not gonna survive this. There's too many of them. Wow! <laughs> I didn't have F. Okay, so there's, there's a button that's missing. Wow. So I have to map that button. It's F. I don't have F. Right, so it says that the one with the pulses and the Okan is the one that did the best. Uh, it always shows you the last uh, robot that was the better one. If it's a Titan, it would probably tell you. So I'm, I have to change this, but I want this to finish. It's, this is just rewards that's giving you. If you finish a match, like uh, if the match is boring, you don't want to play it, and you just exit the match, um, what will happen is it will not reward you. So you have to complete the game. Right, I need to map one more uh, button. I'm going to use my D-pad. The reason why I keep doing this is the only way I can kind of uh, go into this without stopping the game. Go to Profiles. Uh, it's already selected Xbox Gamepad. Select Edit. I need uh, the button F. So I'm trying to think if I wanted to press... Uh, my, my, my mind is saying the top uh, D-pad would make the best. I need an F an F button so I've saved it that's done then I just click on the game itself you see the game didn't stop I didn't disrupt the game and that's it and then uh, I can play another game so this is why I was saying that uh, the Windows key I use it because I need to come out of the game without stopping the game and sometimes if the game itself is not working properly then I would also use the Windows key so I can just come out of the Steam Deck screen and go directly into my uh, Acer monitor uh, because I've got Task Manager running as well and then obviously in there is where I would definitely uh, see what games I've got Right, so um, this one I think is Team Deathmatch because if it was if it was the Beacon one, it would have been showing like uh, where you where you are supposed to uh, go and take the beacons. But clearly this is not showing me. Right, so the buttons that were not mapped on my controller, if you guys are using a Xbox uh, gamepad, it will be different because you you probably do not need to map it. What I mean is that the Xbox controller might be uh, better recognized, you know? Right, so I didn't have thrust, that's left shift. And I did not have, I did not have um, uh, Q, which is the special ability of the robot. I didn't have that ability. And then the other thing that I did not have was uh, I didn't have left shift. Uh, that's for, uh, for, Sorry, for thrusting, and I do not have Q, that's a special ability for the robot, I didn't have that. And um, like now I'm using my special ability on this robot, so I'm moving much faster, and he's trying to run away, but I'm moving faster, I destroyed him, and my ability is still active, so I can still go and attack, and I've got force reload R, so I can now force the reload to go faster, I've, I've mapped uh, Q, on the Juicen's controller for that function. And uh, the other thing I did map was um, for the Titan. Because the Titan I use has a special uh, laser beam that it calls from the top, uh, which is the mothership beam that he uses. And obviously, wow, 
Uh, and obviously I didn't have a button mapped for that. So, in order for me to um, to uh, use the ability that the, it's a laser, it's a mothership actually beam that comes from the top, but it, your Titan can call it down. So I had to map another button, which is the D-pad, which is the up on the D-pad, and uh, I've mapped that one. So now, when I do get my Titan, and I need to launch that uh, ability for the laser, I now have a button for that. Um, if I didn't map these buttons, I'm using DualSense controller. I don't know if it's just a DualSense controller issue, or um, I I'm not saying it's an issue. I'm just saying, I think the last time when I played this on my laptop, I didn't have to map the controller. That's it's kind of strange. When I I used to have two DualSense controllers, you know, so I used to have a purple one, and when I put in the purple one, I didn't have to map it, so it was working perfectly, like all the buttons were working. But uh, because of all this mapping, I've got a lot of profiles for different games, and sometimes I think I use uh, profiles that uh, would work with one game because the functions are similar. This guy's got punishes on him. I'm going to use my laser uh, weapon on him. And he's using his abilities. And he's running away. If I didn't have thrusting on this game, wow, this guy is hitting me hard. I need to heal. If I didn't have thrusting, I could not do things like this. You see? I would not be able to do that stuff. And uh, obviously, <laughs> I can't see him. <laughs> and obviously, if, if you can't trust, then I couldn't do stuff like this. You see, I was about to kill me, destroy my robot. If I didn't have thrusting, I wouldn't have been able to do that. I will just be jumping up and down. And this guy clearly had an advantage over me because he could see where I was. I couldn't see him. He was underneath me. So if I just jump up and down, what does that make me? An easy target. See? Now he's running away. Why is he running? See? He knows. He's not going to stay there because he knows that I'm after him now. See? And now I've got my special ability. Before I get popped, yes, I destroyed him. Nice one. Wow! <laughs> they took me out! They got me! So that's what I'm saying. If you don't have trust in, you can't run away. That's the, that's the thing. You cannot run. You can change the position. You know when, you know, look. Got one, two, and three. If I select up here, you can select it to the mouse. And then you can go up there, you see? So you don't have to uh, be at the bottom. Uh, if you don't have thrusting, you're an easy target. They, they will kill you. Uh, so that's what I'm saying. The thrusting is like jumping, but uh, jumping quickly. Like forward, you know? Or backwards, going backwards quickly. So I can just imagine if you didn't have that ability, you'd be so messed up. Uh, if you shoot this thing and it turns red, the bottom part, there's a plunger there. Any robot underneath there will get destroyed. But the other reason why I did that is because uh, there should be, after that uh, counts down to zero, it should give you like a missile underneath that. You see that? That is going back up. That's a plunger. If that thing hits you, your robot, you will be destroyed. So, you see, that's going to count downwards. I'm waiting. I want to get a missile. And uh, sometimes it gives you a missile. And then you can use it. Uh, to hit uh, someone underneath. Right, he didn't give me the missile. I don't know if they've taken that one away. They used to give uh, the missile. Like a, pur a purple missile. Anyway, let me see what's happening down there. Oh, wow, they got a Titan already. Oh, that dude's using uh, sound. Right, I can see what's going on. Right, I got hit by something. I think those are missiles. Uh, that dude is down there. Oh, that's an alpha titan. That's an alpha. Right, he's the dude with the, with the mothership beam. So if this guy was clever, if I were him, I wouldn't be down on the ground. You should be where I'm, where I'm at. Because you'll, you'll have a much better target system. Like, you'll be able to see everyone. That's an Alpha Titan right there. But I don't know what's up with the crew. Like, no one's attacking that dude. We've destroyed two robots so far. But they do need to focus more on that Titan. They've got another Titan coming. And my team has no Titans. Yeah, this guy is running away. 
they, they need to have a titan on our team and destroy this dude. Yeah, he notices me. He knows that I'm hitting him. Right, so I can't just stay up here. Oh, yeah, and I, I also changed. I didn't have the changing of the, the views. You see, this changing is important because the angle that you will start attacking the robot is so important. So if you don't have it, how are you going to be able to target this dude? He's fighting with one of our titans. So our alpha titan needs help. Oh, there's two alpha titans on our team. Right, so he's, he, he really, I hope they destroy him. Nice one, our team got him. Right, so changing the angles is quite important because when you do change the angle, at least you know how to, um, you see, the targeting is different. This guy's hiding here. If I change it here, you see, I can't see him or I can't aim at him properly, but there I can. So I, I don't know where these dudes are trying to go. And both of them, I know, obviously they got sound or fire on them and I want to attack them or disrupt them. So at least if they focus on me, then maybe my team member can get them. But you know, I'm thinking like going down is better because my weapons are uh, better equipped for, uh, for fighting with these dudes. And people don't seem to know that they're here. Right, so I want to attack them. Right, so there's a dude attacking me as well, I think. Wow, that's a Titan, that's an Alpha Titan. But I don't know where he's gone to. Looks like he's hiding. Uh, the other things have changed. Uh, obviously, graphics. Graphics look a whole lot better. Graphics are a whole lot better. And um, you, you do need this uh, changing of angles, like I said. If you can't change your angles, then how are you going to attack a robot? Sometimes the robot is about to die and he hides and then you don't have the, the, the way to change your angles. And then that guy survives and kills you instead because you lacked the ability to use your, um, use your five senses. And obviously it gets a button that changes your angles. Like right there, you see? That's what I mean. You can change your viewing angles on this game. Right, this dude here is attacking. That's another alpha. A lot of people are using alphas. Uh, this one is a fury robot. His ability is to quick reload, but he is suffering quite a lot of damage. And you see he's backing off, despite the fact that he's got a titan. And, uh, oh, I didn't want to suffer this guy. Oh, wow, 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 oh, wow. This guy is going to hit me now. Is he blind? <laughs> the robot's right here. Where is this dude? Why are you trying to kill me, bro? Why is this, is this guy dumb? What? What's going on? Are, are they not seeing each other? Why, why, why is this guy acting so, so dumb, man? That was so crazy. Wait, do I have a Titan on this thing? Wait, I want to see if my Titan's available. Yeah, I want a Titan. Let's go in there. Ah, oh, man. That was so dumb. Uh, what graphics setting am I using? I'm using medium. I told you guys, you can, you can play this on high if you want to. But uh, my advice is don't, right? So that dude is suffering a lot. I don't know who's attacking me. Right, I told you I uh, using F. I'm using F, which is my, oh, nice one. We got him. We got, we got, we got the dude. He's dead, he's gone. We, ki we destroyed that Titan. But now I've got rockets. Oh wait, is that, is that an alpha? Oh, wow. That is an alpha. Wow, wow. That, that's, that's not what I was expecting. There's another alpha. Uh, our, you see that dude, he suffered a lot. Right, so they're trying to target on the alphas. That's a robot running away over there. The, whoa, damn. <laughs> you got it. I'm like, I don't want to lose my, my Titan yet. <laughs> The Titans are the strongest robots, uh, strongest robots you got on the field. So if you lose your Titan, then it's just a waste of time. Oh wow, that, that that's an alpha. Wait, I, I want to get him in a no that's not an alpha, that's um Ah look at that, he's hiding. He wants to come up here. Right, uh I need the missiles. Right, he's, he's trying to blind me. But uh, 
I'm too dedicated and I do not want to lose my ro my Titan yet. Right, I'm glowing red. I'm suffering quite a bit or a lot of damage. I do need my laser. Okay, get my laser and kill this dude. Because you see, when you start glowing red, it usually means that you could die. Oh, wow. This guy is just mean, man. There's two people fighting me here. Oh, wow. Oh! Damn! <laughs> oh, wow! Damn! They killed my Titan! <laughs> oh!